welcome to a windy day in Aomori. I just had a lovely Japanese breakfast at that ryokan and we checked out, oh my god, the stuff there. I guess the people so pretty to come over to me. It's just so beautiful. Do you hear that? We're here to see some Akita Inu. They have some here in Aomori and I'm so excited. They organized for me with the hotel that I would get to come and meet them because I love them so much. Let's go. Hey, big guy. Why are, you, why are you so angry? Hey, stop with the barking. Yeah, calm down. Yeah, go on. Look at this. There's like a shrine to this dog. He was actually in a movie too. This is amazing. You be quiet. You can buy like snacks. <gasps> he is! Oh my god, he's so fluffy! <gasps> oh! I've never seen snow like this. Ah! <laughs> Look! Oh my god! I am covered in snow. It's insane. <laughs> Let's go in. That walk was so insane. The snow was just coming from like all angles. We're here at the Shamisen Museum now. It's about a 200 meter walk from the station. We call that really cute train up here. It takes 20 minutes. During the train, there was like a blizzard and you couldn't even see outside. It's amazing. I can't feel my hands. <laughs> change of plans so we decided not to go to the Shamisen Museum. We're here at the Osamu Dazai Memorial building. This actually was his house. He is a really really famous Japanese writer. He was born into a rich family as it was. They were all landowners and then he became a really really infamous uh, poet even a uh, writer sorry even though he died like 60 years ago. This was their house. It has 11 rooms on the first floor and nine on the second floor. This is the largest Japanese house I have ever seen it is a mansion it's amazing and it was built in 19 it was built in 1907 that's insane crazy we're on like a train that has two stoves in it to kind of like heat it up and they serve snacks and fish and stuff and it smells like fish on here <laughs> pretty cool Hirosaki now we're going to go see the Hirosaki castle here in the Hirosaki park and it's so beautiful there's so much snow <laughs> crunch 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 <laughs> So 
this is Hirosaki Castle. The original was built in 1611, but in 1627 it actually got struck by lightning and burnt down. It had five star stories before, but now this has three, and this is listed as one of the seven best castles in Japan, even though it is so tiny, but these grounds are so beautiful. Okay. It's snowing. There's nobody else here but us. It's so quiet and peaceful and we got good shots. Yay! I think this place would also be really nice in cherry blossom season around the first week of May. There's a lot of cherry blossoms here over the river which is like frozen and covered in snow. But I think it would look beautiful then too. Oh and if you guys are wondering why I'm like always wearing glasses in my snow vlogs, it's because I have light sensitivity and I can't handle the glare. <laughs> Cheesy nun! Oh my god! Look at that cheese! Oh my god! <laughs> A few moments later. Okay, it looks like I didn't eat anything at all. Like, this is a whole other meal here. But it was so. I didn't have lunch either, but this was amazing. This place is called Karare Yokocho, if you guys are interested. It's really cute. The staff are really friendly. Mm, I'm so full. I have got my sexy robe on. My god, it is so comfortable. And now it's time for onsen. Let's go. <laughs> you can go onsen here as long as you cover yourself up. So I've got these huge ass bandages that I'm going to put on my arms. I put this bandaid on. It's just going to rip my hair straight out when I have to leave. I wish I didn't have to do this on myself. Bandages on my tiny ass tattoos just so I can go take a bath with 30 other naked middle aged women. Let's go. Alright, I am back. So, um, let's talk onsen. That was amazing, honestly. That was so beautiful. But tonight's onsen, oh my god. It's on the 10th floor of this hotel, right? And you can, like, it's set in this little outdoor setting, maybe like 15 by 15 square meters. And one half is like this sitting area, which is just covered in snow. And the other half was the onsen. And it was like all made out of rock. So it was this really shallow rock onsen and you could see out onto the city and thank god it was shallow because it was 45 degrees of pure heat and it was just like they'd made this little japanese garden around and there was just snow scattered on all like the little trees and the rocks and it looked fake it honestly looked like it had all been set up it was that beautiful and actually someone had made a little snowman it was so adorable this onsen here um normally when you go in it's just like this big boring area with 20 or so like wash basins but this one it had like four and four and they were all separate you had walls so you had privacy in between each one they had a cold bath they had like an outdoor area you could just stand in in case it was all too hot for you then there was a sauna and then there was a big bath inside, but the big bath inside was, it probably was about 45 degrees as well, but with all the heat circulating, it was too much for me. I got up to my ankles and then had to go outside. The walk, the initial walk from the inside onsen, uh, from the inside sento to the outside onsen sucks. It is freezing cold, but then when you come back, it isn't so bad. I sat in there and washed my hair. My God, it is nice to sit down and wash your hair if you haven't done it before. Do it. It's amazing. I'm going to go to sleep tonight. I meant now. <laughs> 
you know what I mean? It's our last day tomorrow. I'm not sure what we have planned. We were going to go to a mountain, but I'm way too scared to get on another gondola again. If you guys saw my Akita vlog, you know exactly what happened there. And uh, that's it. I'm done for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please stay tuned for tomorrow. We have some more stuff in store. Oh my god, I talk fast. Okay, I'm going to bed. Good night. I love you all. Thank you for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Has anyone else seen Bridesmaid with Kristen Wiig? And she's like dancing for the cop. Good night. <laughs>